So after a couple of delays and a couple of uh, things changing around, I finally got the Splatoon Pearl and Marina figure. Quick disclaimer, this is just going to be a look at the box and look at the outside contents type deal. Not an unboxing. Again, not an unboxing. Um, and then we're going to get this one and then we're also going to compare it to the, the double pack of the Splatoon Girl. And there was also Boy. I don't have the Boy. I just have the Girl. Um, and so this is kind of going to replace this one for me because I like the... This set a lot more. Um, I don't know why they never did a Callie and Marie, even though they were very popular. This is kind of weird. Um, and this is actually the first time that I got it from directly from the company with this uh, tissue paper on top, which is so freaking nice. Um, it just prevents any scuffing or anything uh, from damaging the clear on the outside and also damaging the box itself. And so I'm going to take this off now and take a look at the box. So, uh, yeah, there's some people that, some uh, figure shops that I bought stuff from and they say that they come with tissue or they come wrapped. They don't. This is like the first time I've ever gotten one wrapped in like 10 years or so collecting Figmas. So right off the bat, let's try to get a close up of them. Try to focus. That, there we go. We got Pearl. She looks pretty good. I don't think these ones have the same gimmick as the first one did. With the um, the eyes are able to move and my chair is not wanting to stay. Okay, let's take a look at the side. Very nice shot of Pearl. Originally, I liked uh, Marina more. But now that uh, I've played the game and, you know, did all the Splatfest and everything, I like Pearl so much more. I feel like... I don't know, I feel like I completely changed on that thought and like her a lot more. So we get both of them and this special like stage type uh, base with two different faces. They have their, she has her mic, a couple different hands. There's a zoom out or a, yeah, the kind of exploded view of everything that it has. The little speaker turntable where Marina's at. Pearl's uh, chair, which is pretty cool. I was not expecting that at all. And in this one, there was no DX version i think this was just it this is the only one you were able to get there's the number splatoon 2 off the hook which is their catchphrase which is interesting they could have just put it splatoon 2 product number very clean shots of them all and this box is a little bit small there we go that's what i really liked i liked how you get you get the chair and then you get also her turntable which is really cool because that's how you you know you see them in the game when they introduce you to whatever the heck's going on for the for the day of. Um, I think that's every single side of the box. Just your standard junk. Get one last close-up of them. Yeah, they do come with different face plates of like the smiling, different eye expressions and stuff. But um, I think it was in the girl one and in the in the boy. And then like this is a lot bigger. This box is a lot bigger. Uh, almost I would say like a quarter of the size difference uh, and this one does come with a lot more accessories and i think i think this was cheaper maybe i want to say not by much though maybe like ten dollars cheaper but it did come out way earlier and i do love how this box is laid out so the front just has the plate like this it's not magnetic there's actually a little clip um, like a little clip tab thing and then you open it up and you get this full graffiti style view of everything in it and you get the same splatters of paint on the outside plastic, which is a very nice touch. Very, very nice touch. And so you got both of them and different um, head, uh, head like um, accessories and whatnot in there. Plus you got the couple of the different uh, wep ink weapons and stuff. So this set is a very crazy set with everything you got in it. It's a very, very good set, but... Uh, that's probably why it's very expensive now to get this set. But I think the Pearl and Marina set is, is the one that everybody's going crazy for now. But I mean, if you have this and the boy, oh man, it's it's just a freaking great set to have both. Oh, sorry, I keep hitting the, the camera. There you go. Get a better look at it. Get a look at the side. Again, I think the top has them, yeah. And that's one really cool thing is in this one you got the roller, uh, which is a very big item, and it's super cool to get it. Uh, and then you get the couple of the the squids themselves and splatter effects. And so this set is a pretty dang good 
when it came out bang for the buck because of all the things you got and i don't think i don't think it mentions on here about the eyes but i think if i remember right the eyes did move these eyes not this faceplate eyes of course but these eyes there was a way there was like a peg or something i think don't quote me on that though i'm trying to go off of what i remember when i saw them but yeah, I always hoped that they would have done more. At least another another double pack of girls, another double pack of boys, or octolings or something. I think that would have been great. So you could have the full set of different, completely different, mixed matched, however you felt like, uh, to do the turf wars or whatever uh, game mode, you know. And then to have these and Callie and Marie, even though they they never did them, I had the amiibos uh, for that to kind of take the place. But then I saw this and I was like, all right, I'm just gonna get rid of the amiibos. Um, because to me, this is a way better, way cooler, um, option to have because, you know, they're actual figures and you get the chair and everything, all the accessories that are included with it. I'm like, this is way more of a value to me and, uh, a lot of a cooler set. So I quit completely ditched the Amiibos and I got, went with this, uh, and then I still have this one, of course. So it's a very, they, they, the color scheming and everything goes together very well. The size, they're about the same size box and everything. Uh, length and width, except for the this side. Um, or whatever. So, uh, so yeah, so that's going to be it for for this one. Here, let me put this up there. For this one, for this quick comparison and look at. Uh, so, sorry again for hitting the camera. It happens a lot. I'm not. It's hard to move stuff back and forth and have the camera right in front of you all times. But uh, there you go. That's going to be the last shot. And you guys can kind of compare which one you like more or which one do you think is cooler uh i think you know i mean this set is really cool don't get me wrong but then this set uh for for when it came out i think msrp wise when they both came out is about the same maybe a little bit maybe a little bit more i can't 100 percent remember for the life of me right now um but they, i mean it just comes with so much stuff this one does come with a lot of really cool stuff but yeah it's it's hard to it's hard to pick i mean if I had to pick one of these, I think I would just go with this one, just because I like uh, Pearl a lot and Marina a lot. Uh, the Inklings, you know, I think they're super cool and everything, plus all the accessories get is a huge, huge bonus. Kind of sucks that uh, there's no way to customize, like, the shoes uh, and really mix it, or they never came out with a, a, a pack. Like, a, could you imagine a Figma pack of of the um, different weapons, like the buckets and the, uh, the Squiffers and the... Um, what rollers dualies uh or like a baller or something or like the uh was it the sprinklers like oh man there could have been like so many cool like add-on packs if they would have done it with this because that would have been so cool because since it would be figma they'd be inter almost interchangeable with all their figma so you could have a really insane turf war you know smash bro style or whatever but uh, that's just a, a thought that i had that i hoped they were gonna do but they never did so uh that's all i got uh for today so um yeah just Whatever you think, which one's cooler. And uh, sorry I didn't open them up. Uh, a lot of Figmas I just like to keep in the box. So that's all I got for today. So thanks for watching.